Um, so a big, a big uh, sort of theme of my podcast and sort of my platform in general is, you know, hustling and grinding towards goals and like the empowerment that you get with that. And, you know, um, but what a lot of folks see is the finished product. So like folks will listen to this album and be like, wow, this is amazing. Um, but the, uh, like probably the hundred thousand hours of effort and practice and stuff that you did to be able to perform at such a high level with such an exceptional group of musicians. Mm. Um, you know, and for you, it's probably, you know, it's, you would love playing music, obviously, but there's also a lot of hard work that has to go into that. You know, I'm sure there were many times in your life where it was a drag, like you're just practicing stuff and it's really hard. Um, but in order to grow, you have to go through, you know, all those, all that, all that hardship and that practice and burning that midnight oil. Can, can you, would you mind just like saying a few words about that? Yeah, sure. Uh, I mean, I could talk about this for hours, um, uh, but I, uh, you know, it's a very, it's a very challenging business um, to be in the music industry, and um, you know, it, you have to keep, you have to keep those two things separately. Unfortunately, uh, separate. Unfortunately, you have to keep your creative mind and the business aspect separate in a lot of ways. And, and I'm very young. I, I still don't have a lot of experience with it, but. Um, kind of to the point that you said I will say that you have to fail to, in order to get better you know I mean there's a million times that I fell on my face when I was in college and luckily college is a good time to do that but I never would have made the gains and this you know if if it wasn't for that if it wasn't for those learning from experiences um I think we're in a pretty interesting time now obviously with uh the cell phones and the way technology has gone i mean i may be one of you know in that last generation that really grew up playing gigs i mean cutting my teeth in the bar passing around the tip bucket um playing for hours and hours you know in new orleans here you know here on Gre in greensboro and stuff like that um and it's just going to be interesting to see how that the next wave now now paying your dues and cutting your teeth is you know how many tiktok videos you got until you you know reach 10,000 followers or whatever so it's just interesting um i feel lucky to to have uh you know to have mentors who are older you know guys who have really especially in this when it comes to music you know you you can't buy experience and you you can't learning from guys who've who've done this their whole life it is really special that's that's so well said man you know the, the these are all things like i talk about a lot on my on my page you know the the power of mentorship um you know yeah. basically failing your way to success which means you're growing you know you you're not going to fail if you stay in your comfort zone and a lot of like what you do is taking a chance you know and you can hear it all, you can hear it all over this album I mean, you guys but you guys everything was executed amazingly well man